So now let's see how we can work with filters and color adjustment effects inside of Snagit Editor. So over here on the right side, you can see that there's filters. So once I click on it, you can see that everything turns black and white because grayscale filter has been added in, meaning everything is in scale of gray. Then you can choose around and do a soften type of thing right here. So there's a soften type of effect. So everything is soft as you can see right here. You can increase out the soften effect right here by moving on the slider as well, just like that. You can go around and go around with sharpen to make it more sharp. As I increase out the sharpness level, you can see that it becomes more sharp. Then you have opacity right over here to make it transparent out just like that. You can then go around into monochrome right here so that everything is monochrome as you can see and everything is perfectly black and white. So you can increase the monochrome to be more black or more white as per the requirement as you can see right here. Kind of like a carbon copy as you can see right there. Then of course you have the grayscale right over here which was selected by default and then you have an option to invert out the color entirely. So these are the options you have for filters. And then you have color adjustment over here. You can increase and decrease the brightness of the overall uh, effect as you can see and work around with the contrast. So contrast is the difference between black and white just like that. You can also change around the hue that changes, ar changes around the entire color just like that on the spectrum. And you can also go over here and add in value let's say for example like 60. And then you can work around with the saturation to increase out the color or decrease out the color entirely just like that as well. And then you can work around with the gamma right here to change around the uh, lightness of the image. And you can see that you can really change out the look and feel of the overall screenshot by using these settings right here. And that is how you can use the filter and color adjustment effects inside of Snagit Editor. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.